Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here, back with more Fuka and Desco Show. In the last episode, Fuka has actually started learning what Prinnies are all about, but she does not want to become one, and she does not want to just stop existing at it either. She's gonna take a third option. Let's see if she can find out what that option is. Let's go. The Last Trial. Oh, I assume you finally made up your mind. Why don't you tell me your conclusion? Will you become a Prinny and pay for your sins? Or will you perish along with your soul? Now, which path will you take? Neither! What? I've only had one goal in mind from the start, and that's to defeat you and wake up from this nightmare as Fuka Kazamatsuru! Yes, Princess! Desko believes in you! <laughs> as expected of you. However, you get an F as a pretty! You fail! I can't send a pretty who has failed my rehabilitation program back to Hades! <laughs> as your comrade, who has fought alongside you for all this time, I shall cast judgment upon you with my own hands! Oh, Val is angry. Whoa, hey now! Is he serious? To conform or perish, those are the only two options that a Prinny has once it chooses to accept this rehab program. But then again, I wouldn't expect a fool like you to understand the consequences of your choices. <laughs> But it's too late now. Your soul, which has denied its destiny as a prinny, will perish here. Cool beans! So I finally made it to the last one. Bring it on! I will continue to live my life as me after I defeat you guys, because I'm Fuka Kazamatsuri! The Big Sis bodyguards are right behind you! Defeat Belly! Again. Fine. The mission accepted. Operation destroyed. Initiating. Huh? You too, Artina? Fix this! We're ready now! Okay, Jesco! <laughs> I see, I see, I see. Well. Good thing Fuka has a lot of friends. Let's go. Oh, my God. 
Okay, that's pretty rad. <laughs> nice, uh, nice reference, too. Luka's friends are her strength, and she's theirs. How could this be? How could Lord Val... What kind of stupid power does she possess? I've ruined the order of this world by failing to convert a Prinny. <laughs> A promise is a promise. I shall not treat you like a prinny, nor shall I impede your foolish actions. In the name of Alvatore! I give you permission to live in this level world as frequently as a world soon. Forever. It's great that her soul didn't disappear, but this situation isn't quite a happy ending. True. What kind of life is Fuka gonna live in the netherworld now? Falzi, thanks! <laughs> For what? Falzi, I know what's going on here. I know you're not that weak. You went easy on me, didn't you? I'm pretty sure he did. If he went in at his real level, this might have been a very different story. All because you don't want me to forget about you. Huh? Is this true, Valsy? What? That can't be! Mr. Vampire? I wasn't aware of that either. But, but could I have been feeling that way unconsciously? <laughs> no, Val, you're just super gullible. There is no possibility of that, my lord. Don't lose yourself to her delusional comments. Listen, you damn nitwit, take that back. Why would Lord Val even think about not wanting to expunge you from his memory? What kind of thought process is that? Well, she may be an idiot, but she's Val's friend. That's gotta count for something, I guess. <laughs> Don't be shy, Fen Fen. I bet you feel the same as Valzy, too. I didn't know you two felt so strongly about me not going through with my reincarnation. Sorry for being so insensitive. Ugh, must you keep... Damsel. Huh? Ben Ben was also? Desco didn't notice at all. Oh, stop! Stop speaking this nonsense! My brain, brain, rot! I appreciate your concern, guys. But, unfortunately, I can't return your feelings, because I... I've already made up my mind. I'm gonna reincarnate. What? Huh? Did Desco hear that right? Big Sis, what did you... I said, I'm gonna reincarnate and start a new life. <gasps> what do you say? I thought you came this far so that you wouldn't have to reincarnate. So why the hell would you change your mind now? You're not making sense to any of us. This eyesore has finally decided to leave Hades. But what is this weird taste in my mouth? Everyone, something is wrong with Desco. Is she... is she dead? 
What? Are you serious? What an unexpected twist! Jessica, get a hold of yourself! She's just going through a system freeze. I suppose this was too overwhelming for her to take in all at once. So she's just unconscious? Man, that scared me! That's actually better. She'd cry and freak out if she was awake. So, lass, why did you all of a sudden decide to reincarnate? Well, you usually forget your dreams as soon as you wake up, right? So I figured it'd be the same thing if I were to reincarnate and forget all about this. I might forget everything after I reincarnate, but if I think of it like that, I bet I can get over it. So I've decided that I'm gonna reincarnate and put an end to this dream. <laughs> After everything you've been through, you still believe that this is all a dream? Th that's cool. Why would you want to be stuck here anyway, right? You are a human after all. Imizel, will you perform my reincarnation ceremony? M me? It's her last wish. Do it for her. Fine. Death Amazel accepts your wish. Wait! No! Jasko does not approve of this! Oh, are you awake already, Desko? Please calm down, Desko. Fuka has made the right decision as a soul sent to Hades. Martina's right. Your big sister's been making foolish decisions. But she's finally deciding to do the right thing. You should support her. As her little sister? But big sis is gonna forget everything about us. That's fine with us. Actually, it's completely fine with me if that happens right this second. Why? Why is everyone being so cold to her? Desko can't believe this! What's with this pathetic attitude? Aren't you a final boss? Fuka Kazamatsuri's little sister? Then accept your sister's decision! Or would you rather trap Fuka's soul in Hades for all eternity? Tesco, you know, everyone will miss her. But it's too painful to watch her soul wander around Hades forever. Sorry, Desco. I've really thought this through. It's been so fun hanging out with everyone, but what am I gonna do here forever? I've already decided to reincarnate. I might forget everything that happened in this dream, but I... Desko! What's wrong? Are you in pain? Bixis decided to reincarnate! This is what Bixis wants! So, as her little sister, Desko! Desko has to support it! Desko has to be happy! Multiplied? Big Sis? Reincarnate? Desco will not accept this! Big Sis is gonna forget about Desco? Like a worm! Desco's body and heart have been split in two by Fuka's decision. My selfishness has hurt Desco so much. Oh, what am I to do? Beaten down by guilt, Fuka wanders the streets as if she's looking for a mailbox to send in a contest entry form that's past due. Ah! 
What a tragedy! Then, a man appears before Fuka. He seems as wild as a wolf with dead fish eyes. Basically, he looks cool and collected. Idiot! Don't torment yourself like that! Oh, Sir Fenric! Although her heart is set on Valvatoris, she couldn't help but be attracted to Fenric's aura of danger and excitement. The wavering heart of a confused girl. Who will she choose in the end? Oh, how troublesome! Poor big sis! Look forward to next time on Legend of Hades, The Love Uprising, Episode 3. Do what the full moon. Big sis, I can't stop this feeling! Whoa, you guys need some help.